Welcome to our channel Planner Tips. In this tutorial, you will learn that how we can create this beautiful water splash animation by using fluid physics properties in Blender. If you want to download this project file, then you can visit my Patreon page. The link of the Patreon is in description. So let's start. First, I open the Blender and import the 3D model of the bottle which I download from the free3d.com website and uh, we create a water splash animation with this bottle so for that we need three basic things to create a water simulation first effector, the second domain and the third is flow, flow type so how we can create this beautiful animation so let's start first I add the plane I also turn on the screen cast keys because you can see which I press nice and uh, I move this plane along x axis something like here press 1 to front view and also move this plane along z axis and rotate this plane something like here and scale it down because I want the water or a fluid emit from this plane and collide with the model of the bottle so now I add a domain so for that I press shift A and here I add a cube and I also enter into the wireframe mode and I scale this cube so that it cover all of our scene something like here and uh, move and also scale it and also I want to scale it along y axis beautiful for one press one for front view and also scale it along z axis and I move it something like here and uh, scale it along z axis beautiful now our domain is ready now I select this plane and I enter into the fluid properties physics properties and here I choose the option fluid and in type I select the flow and in flow type I select liquid and uh, in flow source I enter the amount something like force or phase omission uh, you can increase the amount if you want the more fluid is flow from this plane and in initial velocity I turn on initial velocity and I want the fluid flow from this plane and collide with the bottle so I increase the normal velocity and here I increase its 100 beautiful now I select my bottle and here in fluid properties I convert into the effector and here also choose the option is planar nice and finally I select my domain and in fluid I select the domain and uh, here the domain type I choose liquid and uh, here you can see that the liquid and I increase the resolution up to 64 and uh, here I turn on of all these water collision option and uh, here in mesh section I hit the mesh button and now I enter into the solid view and uh, I also shade smooth our flow bit and uh, run the simulation and check the result beautiful you can see that our fluid is affected by the gravity and I want there is no gravity so for that I select my domain and uh, here in field weights I turn off the gravity to the zero and now I run the simulation and check the result beautiful 
here uh, you can see that the fluid emitted from the plane and collide with the cold drink bottle to create a water splash animation beautiful now i enter into the rendered view here you can see that the scene clearly and i select the water and in material properties i add the material the glass type material to our water and i select by this plane and i turn off this plane in rendered and viewport beautiful and i again run the simulation uh, you can see that the water emit from the our source plane and collide with the water to create a nice water splash animation and uh, here i choose the size of this animation i reduce the number of frame up to 100 and uh, here in domain back to the physics properties here i also reduce the end frame to 100 beautiful back to the timeline and uh, i also make the water shade smooth now around the simulation beautiful here you can see that we can easily create the water splash animation for our product by using the physics properties in blender thanks for watching